This screencast will detail how to use calculator blocks in Aspen Plus software. It will further explore the results obtained after running the chlorobenzene plant simulation in Chapter 6. To begin, open your chlorobenzene plant simulation with a sensitivity study from screencast 7.2 running a sensitivity analysis. On the menu tree under flow sheeting options, click on the calculator folder. Create a new calculator block. For this video, we will study how fluctuations in the feed flow rate affect the two product stream compositions. In order to maintain the molar composition of 95% benzene and 5% water, we are going to use a calculator block. Aspen uses calculator blocks to change multiple variables while only manipulating one. A common application of calculator blocks is when reactants are fed in a specific ratio, for example in steam methane reforming. Enter two new variables, F water and F benzene. Define F water as the molar flow rate of water in the benzene feed stream. Make F water an import variable, meaning Aspen can use it to compute other variables. Define F benzene as the molar flow rate of benzene in the benzene feed stream. Make F benzene an export variable, meaning Aspen will calculate this value based on import variables. On the Calculate tab, place the cursor in the seventh column of the Fortran input block. Type F benzene equals 19 times F water. 19 comes from the ratio of benzene to water in the feed stream. Spaces, spelling, and capitalization matter in this code. If the input is not entered correctly, the calculator block will not work. Next, we are going to use a sensitivity analysis to study how changes in the benzene feed flow rate affect the product compositions. Go to the sensitivity folder on the menu tree and edit the first sensitivity study from screencast 7.2 running a sensitivity analysis. Change the stream component being varied from benzene to water and change the range from 8 to 20 kmol per hour in increments of 1. On the Define tab, define two new variables, F-benzene and feed frac. F-benzene will be the flow rate of benzene in the feed stream, and feed frac will be the molar fraction of benzene in the feed stream. Add the two variables in the Tabulate tab. Run the analysis. By viewing the results of the sensitivity analysis, you can see that the flow rate of benzene did indeed change as a function of the water flow rate according to the formula entered in the calculator block. Feed frac confirms the composition of the stream stays constant as we wanted. Create a plot to visualize the results. We can see that as the molar flow rate of the feed stream is increased, the composition of the monochlorobenzene product stream increases and the composition of the dichlorobenzene product stream decreases. In order to continue to meet specifications, the water flow rate must be between 9.7 and 14 kmol per hour, corresponding to a total feed flow rate between 194 and 280 kmol per hour. This video concludes the Aspen Plus tutorial series. Please be sure to like, comment, and subscribe to the Lafayette CHPE YouTube channel.